So the next thing that happened on AEW Dynamite, we get to the next segment of the night where we see the Ring of Honor World Tag Team Champions, Adam Cole and the AEW World Heavyweight Champion, MGF. They come down to the ring, obviously they're both injured and all that stuff. Adam Cole sits down, MJF is standing up, and uh, yeah, MJF and Adam Cole starts talking about a few things. They was talking about Jay White and all that stuff, and what happened at Full Gear. How Jay White was pr- is a pretty damn good wrestler, but MJF says that he gave him his first ever singles loss at Full Gear, and he has retained the AEW World Heavyweight Championship, and uh, they retained the E-Ring of Honor World Tag Team Championships on the same night. He says not only that, he is the longest reigning AEW World Heavyweight Champion, holding it for over a year now, the youngest AEW World Heavyweight Champion, and the most successful title defenses as champ. So yeah, that's what MJF was talking about. He Then he starts talking about Samoa Joe, how he got to look behind with Samoa Joe. Well, actually, Adam Cole starts talking about uh, how MJF got to deal with Samoa Joe, and then he brought up the devil, and... MJF was talking about the devil at that point and talking about whoever stole his devil mask, they're going to regret it because he's going to get his hands on him. He's going to beat the hell out of him. So yeah, that's what he was saying. But then all of a sudden, the lights go out, the devil pops up on the TV screen, he starts laughing and goes away. So yeah, that's what happened there. And then Samoa Joe comes out there and uh, yeah, MJF and Samoa Joe gets face to face because they got a few things to say. Samoa Joe was talking about how, you know, if it was, he's the one that helped MJF had a good night the first night or whatever, having a good night and stuff at full gear by helping him retain the Ring of Honor World World Tag Team Championships because of his friend couldn't be there for him, talking about Adam Cole and all that stuff. And then Samoa Joe was talking about, well, you know, since that agreement, you know, I owe you owe me a AEW World Heavyweight Championship rematch. And MJF pretty much says, blow me. You can't really hear him because they censor the hell out of it. But that's what he says. Samoa Joe gets pissed off. He grabs MJF and pushes him against the ropes. And Adam Cole tries to get him to cool down and all that stuff. And uh, Adam Cole tells MJF, like, hey, like, you got to be good and all that stuff. Like, you're a changed man. And, you know, Samoa Joe did what he agreed on. And now you should do what you agreed on, you know, and give him the AEW World Everyone Championship rematch. And MJF was like, you know what? Yeah, sure. And, um... Yeah, MJF was talking about, well, how about tonight? And Samoa Joe was like, no, I don't think I want you tonight because I want you at 100%. Because if I beat you tonight and you're not 100%, you're just going to be complaining on Twitter and all that stuff. And complaining and complaining and complaining because he wasn't 100%. And he says, how about at World's End, we can have that match. And MJF pretty much agree. And he goes like, well, I was going to kick your ass in Chicago tonight, but it's better off to kick your ass in my hometown in New York. So, yeah, that's what he says. And, yeah, they're going to be meeting each other at World's End. And then they shook hands, and then MJF pulls them right back and then says something about his way and all that stuff. So, yeah, that's what happened there. Pretty good stuff, though. But, yeah, uh, up next, we're going to be seeing a six-man tag team match up next on Dynamite. So, yeah, see you guys later. Until then.